Well, folks, it is Friday night, and we are just getting ready to head to Vermont. And the reason why we're heading to Vermont is because we're getting our dog, Sadie, a new friend. Uh, we lost one of our dogs last year. We feel like Sadie needs to have a, a friend, a companion. So we've adopted her from a place called Texas Chihuahua Rescue. And they are en route to meet us in Vermont. They've got 44 dogs in this vehicle. Uh, we're meeting them down there to pick up our dog. So we're going to get the cage and the kennel all packed up in the other 2013 Dodge Journey. And we're going to record the trip the whole way. By the time you watch this, we'll already be home and we'll introduce you to the newest member of our family. Well, the dog crate fits, which is a bonus. Good morning, guys. It is just after seven o'clock on Saturday morning and we are getting ready to head the road. As you know, we're headed to Vermont to pick up our new dog. So uh, we gotta get on the road early to make it to Brattleboro to meet the transport. And uh, we've got a very small window to meet the transport. And so we're hoping that uh, my calculations are right and Google Maps is a little bit wrong because they're telling me it takes a lot longer to get there than I think it should. So we'll see how that works out. As we're entering into Maine, the first of a few states that we'll hit today. All right, so we are in uh, we're in the USA. We are headed out of town. I'm just going to make one quick stop at the bank to withdraw some cash and we'll be en route. So we've made it our first leg of the journey. We're about an hour and a half in. We are going through Bangor, Maine, and we're about to hit 95. Well, we're still on the road. It is 1023, so we've been on the road for three and a half hours almost, and we are in Portland, Maine. There we are. Welcome to New Hampshire. It still looks like Maine. <laughs> so we must still be in Maine. Funny. Uh. You ever wanted to take one of those and talk about it? The 59, on right, to I-495 South. And we made it to Mass. Not far now. I guess I cannot rely on my trusty navigator for making sure that we get pictures of the state line, but we are in Vermont. We're only about maybe six miles out from our destination, so kind of getting excited, can't lie. Guess they're supposed to meet us here at this Burger King. This is it. Arriving at 548 Canal Street on the right. And they are not here. See, this is our vehicle transport coming in. Let's go check it out. Just from the coming from Buffalo. Oh wow! Hey, little little, she's so little. She's yeah, she oh, is. She, I thought she was big. Yeah. She's big compared to most of our Chihuahuas. You should see our other one we had that we got from Texas. Oh. Got it. She might want to get down and walk a little bit. She I she had a little bit deep. She has no tail. Look at that. Yeah. Cute dog. <laughs> you can't help. Hi, baby. 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 Hi, baby
perfect. Come on, happy! No, they don't let her chew on that. Come hey, on. baby. She's a bouncy little thing. Well, that's it. We are new owners of a happy, little, excited, full of energy little pup. You don't know what to think of that white stuff. Hey, baby, come here. Come here. <laughs> Has she done anything yet? No. Let's just keep walking with her. Yeah, she's a sweetheart. I didn't think New Hampshire had this many cars to create so much traffic, but apparently it does. Crazy. Hi, babe. So, we are back home. And we put on 1,319 kilometers today. That is a lot of stinking driving. From St. Stephen, New Brunswick, through Maine, through New Hampshire, into Massachusetts, and back up into Vermont. And then back into New Hampshire, back into Maine. And it's about uh, 20 minutes after 10, our time. And we left at 8 o'clock this morning, so it's been a long old haul. Hey, baby.